polish review pretty much of these polishes here. You can do that. Um, anyway, it's complete salon money here by um Sally Hansen. And I've been wanting to try these for like a while. But I just never got around to it. So anyway I picked up this color here. It's Commander in Chief 370. And then this one is Nude Now 230. So, yeah, that. And I have not used this one yet, but I think it'd be pretty cute. This one is what I have on my fingers now. And I did not have a clear coat on. And they're still pretty shiny, so that's pretty good. I haven't had this on for like a couple of days now. Um, this wasn't really a good job. This was my touch up job before a meeting, a meeting I had to go to, so I just kind of redid it over real quick. But I do like this polish. First of all, um, it goes on very good. Um, you would need to do at least two coats. Well, it depends on how heavy hand you are with your polish. But it it's a really thick polish, how about that? So I'll show you. it's not watery or anything like that. It's really thick. So, um yeah, but I just do it twice. And I did these really thin, so I had to do it twice. Because the first time I used it, it took forever to dry because I did my coat kinda thick. And so it was just like Like, are you ever going to get dry? Like, it was so annoying. It was like 30 minutes later, and it's still like, I still have to be like, you know, waiting for my nails to dry. So, you know, this time around when I did, I did a really thin coat, and it was dry like 5 or 10 minutes, I believe, I think. It was a lot quicker than the first one. So, yeah, I would really recommend this. I do not remember how much I paid for this. It was anywhere between 5 to $7. My business, it, like I said, anywhere between five to seven dollars. I really don't remember, but you know, I knew I knew it wasn't like two or three or anything like that. It was between five or seven, and it might have been. It probably was like six something. But yeah, that was it. So yes, I really recommend these. They are um really good. I did probably about um, a week. Yeah, a week wearing this without. It chipping um, too much. So, yeah, I really like that because other polishes, the next day after I've had it on, just like that, chipping. And this is just like on my regular nails because I don't wear acrylic, acrylics or anything. So, um, yeah, that's really good in my opinion. Um, next thing is these strips. I got them from, first of all, I got them from Big Lot. You go in there, well, where I live, where I'm from, they have lots of, like, little, you go into, like, little, um, section where they have, like, makeup and stuff. You can find, like, some good deals and stuff because it's, like, stuff that would normally be sold in, like, um, Walmart for, like, a whole lot higher. I guess they send, like, the extras over to Big Lot. And so it was really cheap, like, Seriously, I've seen these at um, Walmart, and they're like $10. These are like little nail strips. Anyway, and they're like $10. These are just with a simple color. The ones that I've seen at Walmart are like, um, have pattern, patterns on them or whatever. And this is just a simple color in yellow. What's it called? Electric Shock. And then 60 Electric Shock. Yeah. Anyway, 
So yeah, this is only three dollars. Like I said, at Walmart, I probably would have been at least like nine or ten. And I got some big lots. Um, about these. So this is what I don't think it's like. Comes with like one nail file instructions, and then um the little cuticle stick in here, and then here is like two different little packages of nail. of nail strip pieces, like with the different sizes or whatever. And you pretty much size them to your hand. Size them to your hand. And then once you get them all sized for the most part, you, you know, file you style your nail. Make sure it's free of oil and everything. And you peel off the clear part that'll be up there, place it on your nail and file off the free edge. Um the they were really cute when I first put them on. And it's like, heck yeah, I get this bright bold color because I've always liked yellow um, nail polishes, but I've never been able to find one that looks bright like I like it. Like, I could find like neon orange and neon green and neon pink, but I couldn't find like a neon yellow. All of them were like kind of washed out looking. So I was really excited when I found you know, this, and I was able, you know, to use it and it looked exactly right. But the thing about these is, for me, it lasted, um, well, it lasted a couple of days, and it's only because that they're just, they're stick on. It's like, it would start chipping away at the ends. Like, they did it almost immediately, actually. Like, the next day after I took all the time to do it, it was already like if I like scraped it against something, if I was gonna get something like the oil got in, like my hands really, really, really wet like from the shower constantly. It would be like, you know, the tip chipping and that's really ugly to me, but I stuck with it and I think like I give it like a, like maybe like four days and I just end up peeling all of it off because I couldn't deal with the ugly chipness. But a little bit free at first, so I can say they it actually works and everything, and they fit my fingers and everything, and it looked nice. It looked really like um nail polish. That was surprising, but it just didn't last. It wasn't not gonna last. So I'm glad that I paid three dollars for it instead of going to Walmart and paying like ten. So yeah. But if you pick somebody that's like really, really, really interested in just trying it in general, or if you think that you could, um, you know how to keep it from chipping, I would say go for it. But, you know, because I may end up using these again. I'm not sure, but, you know, um, this is another box. 16 strips come in a box that I mean you only get one use out of a box from another box that I had. But um yeah, like I said, I like them but it don't it doesn't last long. I mean the benefits of it is that you know it's a really bold color, it doesn't take that long to do, there's no drying time, you just put them on and you're done. Like there's no glue, there's none of that. It's just a strip. You just lay it on you literally style it down and you're done. So that was the good part about it. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Like I said, these are the all these Sally Hansen products, nail polishes and the strips. And that was just my mini review. I definitely, definitely recommend the nail polishes. Um, like I said, they're not really that cheap, but I mean they're worth it, so yeah. Got some Walmart and the strips. Um that's iffy there. I would not like 100% recommending, but it's not a total sale either. So I hope that was helpful to some of you guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye.